lovely morning. I was up at uh, about half past five and uh, had planned this time to actually get on the beach before dawn and I've actually made it this time. I used to love going on the, the beach at dusk and uh, let's get that down a bit oh, about there. Oh. and getting out of the van about 40 minutes before sunrise I used to do that a lot when I was at Fornham in North Norfolk, but uh, the powers that be, I mean the selfish locals, ban vans, but they don't mind people going in cars in their hundreds and dumping dog poo everywhere. They don't mind that. So Fornham, after all those years of 40 odd years ago came to an end because of a ridiculous attitude towards fans so I don't get to do this often nowadays anyway there's no wind so hopefully when I get back if the wind remains like this, I'm going to uh, tilt all the solar panels. I was actually there's a uh, there's a comet, a comet, visible to the naked eye. But oh, I haven't seen it. You can see it just before dawn. And I can't see it at all. Beautiful morning. Tides out here at South Gear or Gear. Hopefully, to see to see that uh, guinea mark again. And the uh, I think it's a red throated diver. Definitely can't see that comet. Definitely not. Tired is a little here. Yeah. 
see if you're doing uh, landscapes see you can what you can do is you can use the reflection in the beach let's get the exposure in a bit you can use the reflection in the beach as a lead in line like that that's a photo there Just lovely. I see someone in the distance walking the dog. I think they've walked from uh, red car to here, I suppose. Can't see them there. But. Just a gentle breeze this morning. When the sun starts to come up out like that cleared up, I think. My last day here tomorrow, and my plans are head towards Castle Harewood, I think it's called. Cool. Do a Dominic Cummings and uh, yeah. <laughs> so when you're doing photography, is you want to use like lines in the beach, so you can go in the corner over there probably. Have it come around on the roll of feds. Like that. I just took some photos. So. I said it was going to be uh, quite cloudy today. Good old weather, man. I like when they get it wrong. <laughs> See, there's a photo over here. If it's possible still. So you could do this. If you go low, you've got the reflection of the, uh, the old tower. It's going to be coming up soon, I gather. Uh, beautiful warmth on that cloud over there, on the higher cloud, much higher than the others. I'm absolutely covered in sand, I've just been laying on the beach. <laughs> if someone had been walking along then I think, oh my god, there's a dead body on the beach. <sighs> this is where the camera starts to struggle when you've got a really strong light and darkness. Yeah, I'm not going to put the filter on yet. Uh, they don't work very well, I don't think, personally. Uh, Great havoc, actually. Come on, you can see That's it. So heading back there. I haven't gone that far, really, about a mile-ish. No, about three quarters of a mile. I'm going to go to the uh, where all the old boats are and uh, see if I can find the shipwreck what's there there's a small boat there before the tide comes up 
which it is, is it coming up? Yeah, slowly. Oh, camera's having a bit of a problem. Come on, get into it. Oh. Well, that's the solar panels tilt on the van. Gives a couple of, of GI Joes. <laughs> oh, I love it. It's got to be green all, green all day, I reckon. December. Chap I know, and lives in one of them huts over there. Really cool guy. <laughs> 